In this video, I will show you how to view and add categories to PDPs that have been granted to you by the school. In this example, I have signed into my TeachPoint as Teacher 1. I have clicked on the PD tracking, which is this graduation cap here. I'm verifying that I'm looking at all years. I can choose other years as well. But right now I'm looking at all years. Here is a differentiated instruction PDPs that I received and you can see um, there is a certificate that I can view. At this point, I want to add these 20 PDPs to my license category. I do not currently have a license entered on here, so it's not showing my categories. I need to add my license first. Okay, so if your license is already there, you can skip this step. But if you have not yet added your license, you're going to choose Add License. You're going to choose your category, enter your license number, and pick your license renewal date. This automatically knows the uh, expiration date, so you're going to put the start date here, and then you choose save. And here this automatically comes up and shows me how many uh, required PDPs. It shows me how many I've earned and how many I have remaining. Since I just added it, I need everything. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and close this. I'm going to go back and reopen this differentiated instruction. And notice now that I do have this choose category option here. Now I do know that I can use these PDPs for students with diverse backgrounds. So uh, right now it's automatically going to pedagogy. I want to use this for strategies for students with disabilities and diverse learning styles. But I only need 15 there and I have 20. So I'm going to go ahead and split my credits and it tells me I have five remaining. So I'm going to put the remaining five to, I can choose either pedagogy for this one or I can choose elective topics. I'm going to go ahead and choose elective topics. And now you can see of my 20 PDPs, I am giving 15 to strategies for students with disabilities and I am giving five to elective topics and then I just need to save. And now you can see it just says multiple there. But if I view my license, you can see that it did show now that I've earned 15 credits for the strategies for students with disabilities and I own and I have zero remaining. In elective topics, it says that I need to uh, earn 90, I've earned five, and I still have 85 remaining. And this is how you track your license in TeachPoint.